Picture this. You're cruising at 35,000 feet, matching the altitude and speed of commercial airliners. But you're not in a jet. You're in something far more remarkable. The Leonardo AW609 is a machine that breaks all the rules, combining the vertical takeoff ability of a helicopter with the speed and range of a turboprop aircraft. Today, we're going inside this $30 million marvel that's revolutionizing private aviation. The AW609 isn't just another aircraft in the market. It's the world's first civilian tiltrotor aircraft certified for commercial use. Think of it as the private sector's answer to the military V-22 Osprey, but with all the luxury appointments you'd expect from a high-end private aircraft. What's even more fascinating is that this aircraft has been 25 years in development, with engineers solving countless technical challenges to make this revolutionary concept a reality. Let's start with what makes this helicopter truly special, its cabin. Step inside and you're greeted by a space that puts many private jets to shame. The cabin stretches 17 feet and three inches long, four feet and nine inches wide, and four feet and 10 inches high. While these numbers might not sound impressive on paper, the intelligent design makes every inch count. The standard configuration accommodates nine passengers in a layout that would make first-class flyers jealous. Each leather seat is individually adjustable and can swivel, giving passengers the flexibility to create impromptu meeting spaces or just find their perfect position for a long-distance flight. The cabin features large windows that aren't just for show. They're positioned at the perfect height to give passengers spectacular views, whether they're taking off vertically or cruising at altitude. Here's something remarkable about those windows. They're made from the same advanced polycarbonate material used in fighter jet canopies, capable of withstanding bird strikes at over 300 miles per hour. This isn't just a luxury vehicle, it's built to military-grade specifications. The cabin is a masterclass in functionality. Hidden storage compartments are integrated throughout, and there's a separate baggage compartment that can hold up to 1,000 pounds of cargo. The cabin is pressurized, allowing for comfortable high-altitude flight without the need for oxygen masks, and the environmental control system maintains perfect temperature and humidity levels regardless of external conditions. One of the most impressive features is the noise reduction technology. Despite having two powerful turboshaft engines and rotors that can tilt 90 degrees, the cabin remains surprisingly quiet. This is achieved through a combination of advanced sound dampening materials and an active noise cancellation system that makes conversation easy, even during flight. The noise level inside the cabin is just 74 decibels, quieter than many luxury cars on the highway. Moving to the cockpit. This is where the AW609 really shows its technological prowess. The flight deck is dominated by three large LCD displays that form the Rockwell Collins Pro. This state-of-the-art system provides pilots with unprecedented situational awareness and control over all aircraft systems. Here's something fascinating. The cockpit features an augmented reality system that projects flight path information directly onto the pilot's visors during bad weather. This technology, adapted from military aircraft, allows pilots to literally see through clouds and fog making the AW609 one of the safest aircraft in its class. The cockpit layout is remarkably clean for such a complex aircraft. Most traditional helicopter controls have been simplified or automated, making the transition easier for fixed-wing pilots. The side-stick controller is particularly innovative. It seamlessly adjusts its response characteristics as the aircraft transitions from helicopter to airplane mode. The flight computer performs over 2,000 calculations per second during this transition phase alone. Weather radar, synthetic vision, and enhanced ground proximity warning systems come standard, making it safer to fly in challenging conditions. The autopilot system is equally sophisticated, capable of handling the complex transitions between vertical and horizontal flight modes with minimal pilot input. 
In fact, the aircraft can perform a fully automated conversion from helicopter to airplane mode in just 50 seconds. What really sets the AW609 apart? Its performance. At the heart of this machine are two Pratt and Whitney Canada PT 6C67A turboshaft engines, each producing 1,900 horsepower. These engines are so advanced, they can switch from powering vertical lift to forward thrust without any interruption in power delivery. A feat that took engineers over a decade to perfect. The engines power two 11-foot diameter three-bladed rotors that can tilt from vertical to horizontal position in less than 60 seconds. These rotors are made from composite materials that can withstand forces up to 16 times the force of gravity. That's more than most fighter jets can handle. Each rotor blade contains over 30 sensors that continuously monitor its structural integrity and performance. In helicopter mode, these rotors provide all the benefits of vertical takeoff and landing, allowing the AW609 to access helipads in small airports that would be impossible for fixed-wing aircraft. But once airborne, that's when the magic happens. As the rotors tilt forward, the AW609 transforms into a turboprop aircraft capable of reaching speeds up to 316 miles per hour. This helicopter can climb at a rate of 2,000 feet per minute, twice as fast as many private jets. It can also perform a maneuver called hover in crosswind in winds up to 35 knots, something that would ground most helicopters. This isn't just fast for a helicopter. It's in a completely different league. For comparison, traditional helicopters typically cruise at around 150 miles per hour. The AW609 literally doubles that speed while maintaining the ability to land practically anywhere. It can also operate in icing conditions, thanks to an advanced de-icing system that uses hot air from the engines to keep the rotors ice-free. The range is equally impressive. With standard fuel tanks, it can fly for 860 nautical miles. That's enough to fly from New York to Chicago without refueling. The service ceiling of 25,000 feet puts it well above most weather systems, and the pressurized cabin means passengers stay comfortable at these altitudes. In an emergency, the aircraft can glide for up to 20 minutes with both engines out, something no helicopter can do. But all this innovation and capability comes at a price, a steep one. The Leonardo AW609 carries a base price tag of $30 million, making it one of the most expensive civilian rotorcraft in the world. However, that's just the beginning. Operating costs run between $3,000 and $4,000 per hour, factoring in fuel, maintenance, and crew expenses. Each engine overhaul, required every 3,000 hours, costs about $1 million. For those not ready to commit to ownership, charter options are available, though limited due to the aircraft's rarity. Charter rates typically start at $15,000 per hour, positioning the AW609 at the very top end of the private aviation market. Interestingly, despite the high cost, Leonardo reports that the operating costs per mile are actually lower than traditional helicopters when flying long distances, thanks to its efficient cruise performance. The maintenance requirements are equally demanding. The complex tilt rotor system requires specialized training and facilities, and the maintenance schedule is more intensive than either traditional helicopters or fixed-wing aircraft. Leonardo provides comprehensive maintenance programs, but they add significantly to the overall cost of ownership. Each aircraft comes with a dedicated maintenance tracking system that monitors over 10,000 individual components in real time. Despite the high costs, the AW609 offers capabilities that no other civilian aircraft can match. It can take off from a helipad in downtown Manhattan, cruise at airliner speeds and altitudes, and land on a yacht in the Hamptons, all in the same flight. For executives and high net worth individuals who value time above all else, this versatility can justify the investment. 